Hey guys, Silent Sniper 50 here, and um, I'm just gonna do a little commentary on um, on Skyrim. It just had to marry Lydia. If you're wondering how to marry her, as of right now, um, it's bugged. Um, yeah, this will only work on the PC version. I usually need access to the uh, console, which can be accessed with the little squiggly line in the top left hand corner of the um of the keyboard so sorry xbox and ps3 guys uh you're gonna have to wait for um uh, a bug fix and yes you can marry lydia if if you're wor uh, wondering and uh just to let you know um i've already picked up the amulet of mara um which is in riften you just have to talk to the priest okay i'm gonna go ahead and start it <laughs> So, um, you'll find your house, Carl, probably in your house, if you've bought your, ha um, your house, otherwise in Dragon's Reach. So, I'm just going to talk to Lydia here, and, and I am wearing the uh, Amulet of Mara, and I'm not getting the option. Uh, right here, I'm All just right going to show you that I'm actually wearing it, and yeah, I'm not getting the option right now. This might change in the future. Um... So right now I'm entering the cons console, and just make sure you click on uh, Lydia. That's the thing. Uh, you you need to click on her, and then uh, type in adfac space 19801 space one, and then you can exit out of it. And now an you can talk to her, and you'll get the dialogue as you would uh, an in normal person. As far as I know, this bug yes. is for Lydia, Why and wouldn't I be? there might be one or two others that right now you are supposed to be able to marry, but the dialogue Settle isn't showing up. Brief is so yeah, I've just Skyrim. finally Let's made each other. her marry me, and so we're going to head off right now to, um, to Riften to get married. Right I can't wait. So yeah, uh... This is just getting the marriage process of get, just getting married. Um, it's going, I don't really see the point of it. All you get is a home cooked meal each day, which doesn't seem uh, very useful, but nonetheless. Um, yeah, um, if you're ever thinking of getting married in this game, you're probably the first choice you're ever going to think of is um, Lydia. Because it's easy, and she already lives in your house anyway. And also, yeah, if you've got the house, um, you get that spare bed again. Because otherwise, uh, she'll take that up that spare bed, so you can so you can take that uh, that single bed in the other room back in it. Now you are sleeping that. Just a little tip. Uh, so we're heading off to Riften now. So I'm just fast traveling to Riften. Um, sorry, it'll take a few minutes for me to get to the priest because, uh, I'm a little, I'm a little silly. Um, I kind of forgot the fact that it was night time and I kept trying to go, uh, either into the temple or the, um, you could say the or the other place on my right just there to try and find the priest, not to realise that it was night time. So then I eventually uh, waited some time and uh, the, the priest was in the temple. Need a drink? You go to the BM bar. Stay out yeah. of the um, Stay This out while the I'm waiting to, uh, you know, get to the place. You just saw that glitch there where it looked like the door was already open and I had to keep clicking it. That was kind of annoying. There is a few glitches in this game still. Um, but also what I was going to say was, um, that the reason why I won't be doing too many commentaries is, um, I do have school, um, now in year 10, well actually no, of Monday I'm in year 10, which is in Let me guess. a few days, but um, yeah it's a bit hard for me to do it, just failing like a boss here trying to get over the bridge. Um, yeah, the reason why I, I won't be doing many commentaries is, uh, 
Somebody in my house is always home, and I do not like doing commentaries uh, when my parents or my brother are home. It just feels weird. I like my privacy. So Alright, so place. that's why um, I used to go on a schedule, but I deleted all my videos. So just look in the two places that I'm showing you here, this uh, this tavern or whatever it is, and uh, the temple. And you'll eventually find the priest as long as it's after 8 o'clock in the morning and before 8 in the afternoon. Uh, so I'm just going to go back to the temple right here and wait a few hours. <clears throat> so after I've waited uh, 8 hours or so, um, it should be about 10 o'clock, 10.30, game time. And um, I'm just going to enter the building and I am going to uh, arrange the marriage. Guys, um, apparently there's a glitch uh, when the marriage happens. Um, that, whoever it is, it's, it's not just particular to Lydia. Um, but, um... How may I help you, my son? Yeah, uh... Your wife you may walk out on you. I didn't experience this, you but um, it's good to see on before you say your vows, time. and if she does, what you, you just got to do is you just got to exit out of it as fast as possible dust. and catch up to her and we'll talk to her. Otherwise, she'll uh, disappear for a few days. And um, you can probably Google search how to get her back. You just got to got to wait a, uh, a few days right now, the and the then come back to the temple and she should the be there if not just wait four hours apparently that's what people are saying thank you I can i'm a generous you guy donating five use. gold can't deserve a, a medal for that <laughs> but oh well, we're just gonna go out of here because um i heard a little rumor that there might be a glitch if i uh stayed in there but i don't know about that <sighs> so i'm just gonna wait a day here and then the wedding will commence. So, I mean, as I said, weddings in this game are pretty pointless. Yeah, it really doesn't matter. But, you get to live with whoever. But, as you know, Lydia already lives with you, so... Yeah. We're almost done here. And so after 8 o'clock, uh, you can go into the temple and you can get married. So I was about to get married here. There's Lydia. Um, just a little tip. Um, ah, here's the proud groom what was I going to say? Uh, everything opens at 8 and closes at 8 just, just a little tip for shops and everything else um, that's what always happens so yeah um, I mean, I'll just stop talking for a little bit while the ceremony goes on we gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship May they journey forth together in this life and in the next, in prosperity and poverty, and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do, now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? Under the authority of Mara, divine of love i declare this couple to be yeah married. guys after you've done your hours here um it's completely normal if she walks off um it's not the glitch um that i was talking about but um yeah so she's walking off here well not really she's asking me um where are we gonna live she'll just be outside the door um so, but if she doesn't, if she leaves and doesn't ask you where you want to live, um, that's when it's 
you gotta sort of catch up to her and you know, talk to her. So I'm just gonna talk to her now. And we're gonna live in my place. I don't know, you can choose what you want. But personally, White Run's pretty good. I am your sword and your shield. Oh, that seems a little uh, dog that she walks out on you after the wedding straight away. But uh, you just meet back, back at your house or wherever you selected. So I'm gonna go back to White Run, and I did not click on the stables. That is ridiculous. But oh well, on White Run. So the wedding's over. Um, there's nothing really much that you can do. Except for get a home cooked meal, and I'll just show you that in a, in a second. So that's generally how you get married. Um, this is another little tip. Um, if you're on the PC version and you're using the console to try and get somebody to marry you, um, just make sure you check the wiki first. Um, because not all characters are actually meant to get married. Lydia is one of them that that is just bugged and you actually can get married to her. But, um... Yeah, just to let you know about that. Um, so she's not here yet. I'll have to wait, wait a couple hours. But, um... Just to let you know, um... Get the Amulet of Mara. Even if you're going to do this. Uh, with the console, because I'm not actually sure if it will work, even if you, even if you do the console thing, um, without the amulet Amara, so I just recommend getting it anyway. It does give you a bit of bonus wearing it. It's not just the ability to get married. But here she is, Lydia, walking in. So I'm Masker. Get me a home cooked meal right here. Get back in the kitchen, bitch. What do you need, my thing? Yeah. Take a look. Oh, I'm just gonna ask her. Um, see what she has. I felt uh, pretty shocked that I have to still have to pay full price for everything. But oh well. You get some benefits. <laughs> oh well. And I will be doing more Skyrim stuff. Um, mainly uh, glitches, um, like coin glitches and stuff. Well, not really coin glitches. Things that you can just exploit to make to make better. Um, there is a glitch where you can get coins. So. Um, if you're interested to see how you do that, it might be on the web already, but um, yeah, I stumbled across it. Take a look. Uh, so just tell me if you want to see that, and I'm just gonna sit in the chair Keep by the fire up. and eat my home cooked meal. See you later, guys.